It's a self-fulfilling prophecy, as well as Catch-22. Space becomes universally popular, pun intended, when everyone gets to go there. Space is like lingerie. It's only when someone's in it that it becomes interesting. But well, low Earth orbit can be a desirable, even a luxurious destination if we focus our efforts on creating space, large internal volume, habitat, hotel, symbol of sphere on orbit. Fill it with an airtight liner and a breathable atmosphere, and then the visitors, the guests, if you will, have the infrastructure brought up with them. With each successive launch, more CO2 scrubbers, waste recycling, water, fuel, food, disco, mirror balls, bubble machines. Orbit becomes a destination. We close the space first. A space tourism society, a space tourism industry, fills in the details as we go. To me, it's more important to have a local destination designed to impress, which will attract large numbers of flights, which will in turn require a new commercial scale maturity in our launch operations, which ultimately will bring flight ticket prices down within the reach of everyone. Rather than uh, some decades long struggle to put a couple of government scientists on Mars. But it, it's really the near term answer to the question that's the key. What can we as Americans do now for the future of human space flight. Well, start by telling the story right. How can ordinary non-geeks get excited about their prospects in space when all they see on the TV news is a bunch of jumpsuited government employees in a cramped travel trailer filled with experiment racks in orbit? We know better. We, space aficionados, know the potential of even low Earth orbit. As Heinlein says, halfway to anywhere. We need to rebrand space away from government programs, away from military paradigms. Point your friends to the accomplishments of the entrepreneurs, but don't stop there. Make the connections for them. It might be obvious to you why a Bigelow Aerospace launch is more encouraging than adding another module to the ISS. Maybe not so obvious to them. Remind them that Space is bigger than government. Space is the embodiment of freedom. There's nothing sacred about space. It's just the rest of the place. Time we moved out.